Brownsville County woman is in California right now working with the Red Cross to help combat the wildfires. WNCT's Kara Gann has her story. Charlotte Rodriguez tells me the sights she is seeing right now in Northern California have been heart wrenching. Her and her crew at the Red Cross have been working day in and day out trying to provide these wildfire victims with some relief and shelter. Many people have lo totally lost their homes. We've lost over a thousand homes totally. I spoke with Charlotte on the phone and she told me as the firefighters are working overtime trying to put out the wildfires, her team at the Red Cross is working to help those who have been displaced. Especially for people who've lost their homes or don't feel safe in their homes, we're providing shelters, and our shelters are safe and secure. While they're in the shelter, of course, we're going to feed them, and they also have access to our health services and our mental health uh, personnel. We have four what we call emergency response vehicles. They're the red and white vehicles that people know when they see them coming, there's hope coming. She says they're also providing people with supplies to clean up their homes, trying to help them get back to normal. They might include a rake and a shovel and a large tub of just basic supplies. She says this is a very emotional experience for her to witness. It's heart-wrenching. It really is. And uh, as I said, you feel a, a kinship to these people. Uh, there's never too many hugs that you can't pass out. And in a time like this, strangers are not strangers. We're all we're all family. And often, you know, you just drive down the street and you red cross car, and people will honk at you and and stop you. To, and I'm getting emotional thinking about it. And you have to have some empathy and put yourself in their place. It they're losing everything. It's not just a building. It's their lives. Charlotte tells me the Red Cross is always in need of volunteers or donations. If you would like to help, you can visit theredcross.org. In Greenville, Caragan, 9 on your side.